In this video we will learn how to connect Freenom domain with Blogger Hosting. You already know that Freenom is a free domain provider website. People use these free domains for their test purpose or temporary use. On the other hand, Blogger is the most popular free web hosting service out there. Millions of people are using this smoothly. So today, I will show you how to add a Freenom domain on this Blogger website. Here I have a website installed in Blogger, but usually, Blogger gives you a subdomain of blogspot.com. So, let's log in to our Freenom account. Log in with your email and password here. We need to find out the domain first. Under Services section, click on My Domains. Here you will see the whole list of Freenom domains you registered. I will add this domain with Blogger. You see this domain is blank now. No hosting is associated with this. Now click on Manage Domain. OK, stay on this. Now go to Blogger Dashboard. Click on Settings. After scrolling for some moments, you will find the Publishing section. Click on Custom Domain. Now write the desired domain. And save. See, they are showing an error. Actually, we need to add www prefix before the domain. After trying to save, you will see another error. Blogger is not unable to verify the domain ownership to start proceeding. You just need to prove that this domain is only yours. To do this, we have to do some technical work now. Go to the Freenom domain management page. At first check the name server, you must select the default name servers for this. Then click on Manage Freenom DNS. Here they are given some instructions. We need to add CNAME record in the DNS management of the domain. Copy the name, and go to the domain management. First, select the type of record as CNAME, and paste the record name, here. Then copy the destination, and paste it on the target box. Then press Save Changes. Here you see, they have given another CNAME record to set up. As like previous, copy and paste the CNAME record and destination to the DNS management page. The work is not over yet. Click on the support page link below. After scrolling, go to the step 3. Here you will see something like this. They are saying to add some DNS records too. This time we will add some records, and the destination's IP address are given below. At the name, write the domain name. and paste the copied IP address on target box. Then save changes. The record was added successfully. Now we will add the rest 3 a record like this. Copy the custom domain each time, and paste it to the DNS name box. And copy the IP address and paste into the target box. Follow my video directions. So, all DNS records are been set up. After setting them all, now go to Blogger Settings and click Save. Here it says, could not update settings. Actually, DNS propagation takes 1 hour to 72 hours to complete. 
I waited an hour. Then I tried to add this custom domain. And it worked smoothly. The domain is added successfully. If you click on View Blog, then you will find out that the subdomain is no more, it is now showing as the custom domain. It is showing a broken page because we have some settings to complete to show this page is fine. Enable redirect domain. And you see the website is showing a not secure warning. Enable HTTP's availability to make it secure. Again, you must wait 20 to 30 minutes to complete the redirection. Yes, after waiting, now it is working fine. Also, it shows HTTP's secured website. So, every element of the website is working perfectly. This is the tutorial on how to connect Freenom domain with Blogger hosting. If this video helped you then please hit the like button and subscribe to motivate us.